Squarespace email marketing tutorial step by step. Hey guys, welcome back. Today we'll be doing a quick look at the Squarespace email marketing platform, how you can use Squarespace not only for your website building needs, but also to complete some basic email marketing. And they have a bunch of different easy to use templates with a simple drag and drop editor, as well as consistent uh, templates that you can create and color schemes and branding that you can apply to your uh, emails as well. And they also provide you with real time analytics, such as how your campaign is performing, how many people clicked on the emails, how many people viewed them, so on and so forth. So let's get into signing up with Squarespace. So the first thing you have to do is simply head on over to squarespace.com. Once you're on squarespace.com, just click on get started in their marketing tools to select email marketing and you will just continue on with some basic information. Now, after that, you just have to choose how you would like to get started. So if you want to build a custom template with the Squarespace blueprint, and this basically allows you to have a um, brand aesthetic, so a brand color scheme, you can apply that branding throughout the rest of your emails as well. But if you're someone that is not familiar with design and you want to get started with a pre-existing template, simply click on choose a professionally designed website template. So you can choose any website template over here, but we're going to go jump into email marketing. But you do have to, you know, build a website first. So I'm just going to continue with this one. So now, as you guys can see, I have this website and my website template. And uh, with my website template, you have two options. So you can use your own domain host like GoDaddy, uh, MailChimp, or any other email marketing tool that you might want to use. That's totally up to you if you want to choose one of those. However, if you want to choose the Squarespace email marketing tool of itself, just open the website that you want to build your campaigns for. Once you open it up, this is going to be your website. So on the left, you have this section of design, pages, commerce, all of that information. So you have a bunch of different tools on the left. And all you have to do is click on marketing. And then on the top, you will find email marketing. So you can just select that. And now you guys can see you have your email campaign. So from here, you want to click on create and then you can start creating the campaign that you want. So, for example, let's say for our website, I want to create a just regular email that I send to all of my customers. And now you guys can see it will show me all of the templates that are available on Squarespace. So uh we have a bunch of different templates and let's say i just want to announce a new collection that is coming so i want to click on announce or promoting a product or service and you guys can see this is like a nice little email template and i will just click on use this template over here on the top right and then on the top you can add your own logo this is a logo image i can click on delete on the right side of the screen and then I can insert my own image. I don't have a logo image, so I can just uh, actually choose a logo from my Squarespace website that I might have uploaded, but I haven't added a site logo. So I'm just gonna continue on over here and I will uh, change up the section to a text section. And I'm just gonna enter this. I'm gonna enter the font size, make it larger, and change the color as well, but I'm gonna keep it black. Then after that, you also have the selection color, so you can provide it with backgrounds, but I don't want a background, so I'm gonna keep it at white. Now, after that, I am going to click on the next section. You can replace the text. Obviously, you are going to customize it to fit your new launch or to fit your email uh, needs and then on the bottom you also have the logo in the footer so you can click on that logo over here you have the branding you're going to click on that and click on delete and i can click on text once more and then i will enter my branding like this now make sure you don't remove the unsubscribe button because that is mandatory to have in all emails now, once you have created this, you can click on your email section 
on the right side of your screen this was our styling section so you can click on email section and in the email section you will add the subject the preview so basically how this email is going to appear in your customer's inbox so over here we're going to type in the subject uh, which is new draw and then you have to and from so you can add who you want to send this email to which is going to be all subscribers if you want to do that but if you want to send it to specific subscribers let's say it's a pre-launch for only your customers that have you know uh, been in a certain segment that are hard spending customers so you can choose that from over here but we're looking to send this to all our subscribers and then you have your sender details so you can click on add sender and from here you are going to add your sender email obviously with this kind of business email you will have to verify it and i will verify it later but you do have to verify that this is your email so after that, you can just click on send to recipients on the bottom right, and that is all you have to do. Now, uh, with this, you also have some other options. So first, I'm just going to edit my sender details. And you can see, although Gmail uh, usually gets marked as spam, you still can uh, send via a Gmail email address. However, I would recommend that you make sure that you don't... Um, use gmail because it just doesn't look and seem very professional at the end of the day it's really not um what a lot of customers want what a lot of customers would find to be accurate so you guys can see once you have completed your sign up process and your verification your email marketing campaign can now be sent now once you send your email marketing campaign you have uh you know your basic analytics section and you guys can even see your scheduled emails your sent emails and create automations so with every email marketing tool you have the automation section in our automation section currently we can't uh you know use it because it's a premium only feature and with uh squarespace it is limited to uh some basic emails and i do think that if you want the full use out of squarespace and their email marketing tool you do have to subscribe to a premium version however if you just want to get started and you've already built your website with squarespace it's a great option to get started with so that was it for today i hope you guys found this video helpful make sure to like this video and subscribe to the youtube channel and comment down below the best tips and tricks that i have taught you within this video and make sure to also share this video with your friends and family and to other creators as well so you can help them out as well and to anyone that might need to know this basic detailed platform and how you navigate through these different social websites so I hope this was helpful enough for you and make sure that you do leave a comment down below if I missed out on anything and if there is anything you would like to add and I will catch you guys in the next video.